What's going on YouTube? Jeans here, bringing you guys part 9 for my playthrough on Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. So guys, in the last episode, we completed the Frosty Forest and defeated Articuno, the third and final legendary bird. Now we're moving on to Mount Freeze to go visit Ninetales. So if you guys are excited for today's video, make sure you support the channel and this playthrough by smashing that like button and clicking that big red subscribe button. Seriously, it goes a long way. It only takes a second of your guys' time to help support the channel. So we already deposited items. I did that all off screen, all that. So we don't really need much. And we're actually just going to get rolling here. Hey, Chico, are you ready? Yeah, yeah, we are all set. Which way should we go? Okay, so we can go to Mount Mount Freeze or Snow Path first. So we're gonna go to the Snow Path first, just to set up, just in case there's a boss fight. I know we have to travel up there to go visit Nine Tails, but there might be a boss fight. Not too sure. Not too sure. But yeah, let's get rolling out here. So Rain Dance comes out here, and we're just here to pick up items and do some work here. Let's go. We got Absol on our team now. We actually picked, picked her up in the last episode. She's a beast, level 28. He or she, I don't even know if it's a boy or a female. Let's go. Somebody take this out so we can just get rolling. I'm not worried about like beating up Pokemon, getting XP. I'm worried about grabbing items and being prepared for the big dungeon. I believe Mount Freeze is like huge. I think it's like almost 20 floors. That's insane. Let's grab some more money too. Grab that orange berry. Somebody pick that up. Thank you. No, Mudkip, you just walked past it. Mudkip legit walked towards it and then was just like, nah, fam, I'm not getting it. I'm like, bro, what you mean? <laughs> We're gonna get moving here. Where are the stairs? I just want to do this real quick. Get some items. Maybe find a Kelkion shop. Could be nice. Could be nice. Grab some items because I know we have like a thousand Poké Dollars right now. But I believe after this we will make our way back towards the town, which is awesome. Which is awesome. We haven't seen town in years. In years. We've been fugitives. Now where are these stairs? There they are. I was gonna say. Yo, we traveled this whole place right here looking for these stairs. Let's go snow path. I believe it's only like five floors. Look at this. We got that Poké Dollar. We have an apple here, which would be nice for us. And then we have a uh, a seed there. Hopefully that's a tiny reviver because those are the best seeds. And you guys know that for a fact. This thing coils up. What, what you want, fool? Rain dance, big damage. I'm not even able to hit these things. What's that? Tiny reviver, beautiful, and an apple. Let's get rolling. Let's get rolling, peeps. What we got over here? Another apple. Is it worth it? Actually, yeah, it's totally worth it. I'll fight you. As Zoomerail. Iron Tail. 451. Big stamina damage. Oh, 85. We get a crit. Was that a crit? Oh, no. We lowered its defense. Oh, we can't go this way. Move, peeps. Are you kidding me? Dude, Snow Run just sniped me with an icy wind. I'm not trying to deal with him. <gasps> I'm dead. Oh, he missed. He missed. Alright, I'm gonna swap with you. Go ahead. You do your work. You do your work, dude. Luckily, he missed. He would have murked on me and took me out. But yo, Absol's hitting like a truck. Absol's hitting like a truck. What you want, Furt? What you want? Let's go quick attack and I'll just drag him breath here. Yeah. Get out of my face. Let's roll. Where are these stairs at? So yeah, we are getting good items. We got some apples for our journey. More tiny reviver seeds, which is wonderful. Just dandy candy. I'm bang, here's stairs, baby. Let's get rolling. I'm level 23. I think our levels are decent for right now. I think we are. We could be able to roll out. I think once we get back to town, we use a couple dojo tickets and we level up that way. I think that's perfect. This thing's gonna double team. I'm gonna just take him out with this. Look at all these items on this floor. What we got here? Pokey Dollar, Pokey Dollars. Oh, and would, would you guess? More Pokey Dollars. Absol, you can handle yourself. Thank you, Absol. Absol is actually a great addition to this team. It's level 28 and it's very strong Pokemon. It's gonna be nice to actually bring her back to the uh, the town and use her in other dungeons. Bam, 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 bam. All right, let's roll, baby. What you want? Yeah, Mount Freeze is gonna be a little long, so I gotta make sure I have a lot of apples, all different stuff to be able to complete this journey. Like I said, it's like I think it's I believe it's like 20 floors. I believe it's around there, maybe 18 to 20 floors. Big boy, big dungeon. I haven't did a dungeon that big yet. Let's go, Snowpet. Yes, there is a Kalkion shop. Just what Jeans wanted. Just what Jeans wanted. What you got from here? Got some orbs, got some berries, got some apples. Right, let's see what kind of orb this is. We got to revive all orbs. Use it, revives all your fainted teammates. But once you go to the next one, you won't be able to revive teammates except in the main one. Um, I'm not sure how I feel about that one. We have another revive all orb. They're expensive though. What we got here? Got a Confuse one. I'm going to pick that up. Actually, no, dude. That's expensive. Can I drop the Confuse one? All protect gives you protect condition, which protects all enemies for a while. That could be good. I'm going to definitely pick up this orange berry and this, uh, this apple. And what we got here? The petrified wand. I don't really think I need that wand that we picked up. But I think I have to buy it now. <laughs> Once you grab it, I think you need to buy it. So yeah, we'll buy it. You know, screw it, dude. We'll buy it. We're out of here. All right, now it's head. Let's go find the stairs. Yo, what you want, Stone Run? Dragon Breath. 34, step up, dude. Oh, yeah, that was dumb. That was dumb. Step up to a Trico with Iron Tail. Boom! 55. Get him out of here. Get him going. All right, so he's dead. Let's get smoothing along. Smoothing, smoothing, yeah. Go here, stairs. Do I go for the items? Heck yeah, I go for the items. Heck yeah, go for items. Do you want snow run? Actually, nah. We're, we're, we're just gonna take out the snow run and then we're gonna get rolling. Water gun's gonna finish him off. This thing's gonna ice shard over on the absolute. I'm going back to the stairs. Come on, Kip, take him out. Thank you very much, my Kip. Oh, and we get a level. Trico levels up. Let's go. 24. Any moves? Any any good dandy moves? Yes, I level up. 
And no moves. Let's get moving. Is this the end? I think we might have one more floor. Nope, that's the end. There we go. We finish up the snow path. So we get some items. We get all that good stuff. I'm just going to go into my box now, see what we got, and then head up to Mount Freeze. Another loot path. But these things are nice, considering if you're not prepared or maybe you died in there and lost all your items. You can go back, do the loot path, get a bunch of items and all that good stuff, and then prepare yourself. We're going to deposit items here. Let's deposit. Hmm, Geo Pebble, you're out of here. Um, apple? I feel like all these apples are good, but we'll keep three apples. What else we got? Yeah, we'll keep three apples. We'll get rid of our confused one. I'll hit A. And then I'm actually going to, uh... Let me see the items that we have. Let me see the items that we have. So, just we got three apples, elixirs, orange berries on deck. And we're going to get rid of an orange berry here. Uh, petrified and slow one I'll get rid of as well. And then we'll actually go to the witch all items and we'll grab some other stuff before we do roll out. We'll grab, um, I don't think we need any more apples. I really do not think we need any more apples. We'll grab a petra berry for sure. Uh, we'll grab some ethers. We'll grab two ethers here. We can definitely stack up on them later. Um, what else do we want? What else do we want, man? Oh, we could take maybe a wand with EQ. Here's a look at all of our TMs, baby. Yeah, I think we're chilling. I think we're chilling with that. We'll find a bunch of items in there. But let's get rolling. Let's get rolling to Mount Freeze, yo. This is going to be a big journey. Why'd I hit no? Why'd I hit no? Get out of my face. Yes, I am ready to go. We are all set here. Let's get rolling. We're going to Mount Freeze, baby. We're going to Mount Freeze. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Making our way to the top to visit Nine Tails. Dude, this is going to be hype. Long dungeon. Long dungeon. Oh, my God. We already got this thing. I forget what this thing's called. Like, uh, I, I totally forget. Let's see. Let's see what's going on. Probably has something crazy. It's Zangus. That's what it is. I, I remember it was like Zigzagoon, kind of. Oh, yo, there's a Kelkion shop here. But look at all the pokey enemies on this team, on this, uh, floor. Are you kidding me? Like, what you mean? There's so many. <laughs> so let's finish this thing. Okay, so there's going to be ice Pokemon, probably to control most of this. But we're going to head over to this Kelkion shop, see if we have anything good. Dodge that enemy. I'm going to try to reverse it. We got Orange Berries and Bands. Not bad at all. I'm going to grab this band. What's this band? It's a nullify band. When equipped, it prevents the wear from... Okay, never mind. And detect band. Eh, not too good, either of them. I'm not even, I don't even think I'm going to pick up anything. I ain't going to pick up anything, Kelkion. I'm out of here, dog. Thank you so much for showing me your business. And seeing what you got, but... I'd rather pass this time around. Alright, let's get rolling. Uh, let's go down here. I'm, I'm not trying to face off with, like, every single enemy on the floor. Oh, whoa! We got a Vigoroth! So that means a slacking could be up higher and higher floors. Yeah, oh, of course we miss. Absol, give it some. Oh, Absol's hitting like a truck, baby. Pursuit's critting on everybody. Get out of here. Let's roll. A lot of hit here. Scratching me? Yeah, that's why you get that gig in there. Mudkip, send that water gun. But it's nice to have this third Pokemon actually help us out in battle, especially a level 28 Pokemon. Like, nice, type nice. What we got here? Oh, I got a warp trap. Are you kidding me? You're lucky it warped me to the floor. You're lucky it warped me to the floor. So warp traps are a pain in the neck, actually, because they uh they warp you to a random floor, and you can't do anything about it. So you're just away from your teammates at that point. So it warped us away from teammates, but luckily it warped us to the stairs. So now I can just use the stairs and go back with my teammates. Let's go mount. Oh yes, dude, the stairs are right here. The stairs are right here. So we're just gonna finish off this uh Zangus. Are you kidding me? Quick attacking me like that? That's why I'm gonna send Absol on you. What you want, fool? Get that dragon breath. You're gone. You're gone. Absol hits like a truck. Hitting like for 50 something. No, we don't want that. I don't like I don't use the pebbles. I don't use the rocks. Maybe I could sell them back in town, but still right now I don't use them. Oh, nice little What do we got? Tiny Reviver Seed. Ooh, we the best. Dude, why am I hitting all these traps? A little slow trap. So now I'm gonna have to step out over to the side and finish off this bigger Or Vigorith, however you want to pronounce it. But what you want? I'm just gonna quick attack this. Boop. Have a step up. There you go. Use quick attack. Are you feel your bruh? What you mean, yo? Fury swipes? It's like an absolute truck in this game. It's like five shots of like 20 sometimes, and it's just tees off on you. So that is such a dangerous move in Mystery Dungeon, but not really in like a regular Pokemon game. It's like the weakest move in a Pokemon game, but in this game, it's like, yo, it shreds. It's, you don't want to mess with it. Now this guy's Poke Dollar. What you want? Zangus, baby. Get ripped up, baby. Water gun. In the rain, yo. I love, I love that I gave Mudkip that water gun. I'm a huge fan of giving him that water gun. It is probably the best move I gave him considering it just he just sends it and he does more damage all around And it doesn't affect me. It doesn't affect me. Maybe if we had a fire Pokemon it would affect them But it doesn't affect me right now. So maybe when we get a fire Pokemon on our team, all right, we gotta head back There's nothing. So Why am I hitting all the traps? Get out of my face. I'm not dealing with them. We got Zangus ready Are you kidding me? We missed water gun comes out here. This thing very swipes and kills me. I'm gonna cry a little bit Um, I'm just iron tails. Hopefully it connects area. Water gun should take out. Good. There you go, water gun for the KO. Right, I want my stats back to normal. We should have went up from here because I believe the stairs are just chilling right here. Yes, they are. Give me that money, though. Give me that money, though. 
We'll head on to the next floor. What floor are we on? Four. Four out of about 20. Okay. Rain Dance, yes sir. I'm telling you, that's the best move I gave him ever since I gave it to him uh, with Moltres. It was so nice. It was so nice because it nullified all that Moltres fire attacks. And we just did, well, Mudkip just did bigger damage on this water. So it helped us out tremendously there. Yo, take him out. Please take him out. Yes, sir. We'll get this. Dude, tons of enemies again. I'm not trying to deal with them. I'm not trying to deal with them. <laughs> She's gonna make her way this way. Yeet. Where are them stairs at? Oh, there they are. What we got? More money, dude. How much money are we picking them out? 18. I hate how sometimes we get a lot of money and sometimes we don't get like any money at all. It's such a pain. It's such a pain. Dude, stairs are right here again. Well, I'm gonna take out this enemy just to get some XP. Who is it? It's a seal. Go ahead. You, you, you have this, yo. His quick attack does a poop ton of damage and he gets me a box. And you get me a box, yo. Boxes are the best. You know it. Especially when you're doing like a big mission. Like not a big mission, like a rescue mission. And it's like bonus loot. Oh, look at it. What's this thing called again? It's like a chim chime or something. A chimicho. It's a chimicho. But the best is when you're doing like a mission with like boosted loot. And you get tons of boxes and you just rack it all up. It's insane. You get so much stuff. A pineco, dude. I love pineco. Such a cool Pokemon. Go step up, pineco. Ready? Uh, ah, yeah. Uh, I'm just waste a turn here. Uh, I didn't even mean that. <laughs> Alright, now I'm gonna step up here and go into a quick attack. Or no, he's gonna step up with me. Alright, tell him. Boop. See you later. Get him out of here. Get him going. Orange berries. Love him. Uh, let's go right. Let's go right. I'm feeling a little bit of right action. I don't know why. I, I'm feeling it. That's probably not it. There's a floor up here. <gasps> Yo, are these. There are T Tars on this floor? We got a Pupitar. Does that mean there's T Tars coming up higher? That'd be insane. That would be insane if T Tars come up here. And just start swamping on us. That'd be crazy. Ooh, is that Kelkion Chop? Yeah, that's a Kelkion Chop with five items in it. We got Link Box, Orbs, Berries, all that good stuff. Uh, I just want to see this Orb. What kind of Orb is it? No, five Orb. Again, I, I, I don't want it. I do not want it. <laughs> not at all. Not in the slightest bit. That was a terrible Kelkion Chop. We're getting some poo-poo Kelkion Chops. <gasps> a Swine Up! Man, I wish I could befriend Pokemon. I would love to have an Altaria on my team. Oh my lord, that would be gorgeous. That'll be the lovely Pokemon of a lifetime. Yo, step up, Pongo. Got quick attack, yo. This absolute quick attack is so good. So he's gonna protect. I didn't even mean Iron Tail. I didn't even mean it. I, like, I, I don't like this game. <laughs> but Giga Drain, boop. 37. Give me my HP back, dude. And we'll kill that thing off. Like, you gonna rap me? What you mean? Now, now, now you're done, buddy. Now I'm gonna quick attack you. And now Absol's gonna. Oh! Get that super effective bite on you. Now I'll bind it. And I get out of this bind. Thank you very much. Now let's roll. Let's roll, baby. I think me. I think I should learn a move soon. I don't know what move, but I want to learn something nasty. I want to learn like Leap Blade. <laughs> Yo, get shredded with that. But I can't wait to actually evolve my Pokemon. That's the one thing that is all right about this game is you have to wait post game to evolve your Pokemon. I wish it was kind of based on levels. That would be a lot better. Of course we miss. Of course we miss. What else? What, what else? What else would happen? But yeah, I don't really like that you have to wait post game to actually evolve your Pokemon. I'd rather just get them all now. But Kipper levels up. Let's get it, baby. Get it, Kip. 24. You want to learn a move, buddy? Anything good? Anything good? No. You don't want to learn anything. But I'm going to tee off on you. Kick it, Jane. Yeah. I wish Absol was behind. Oh, we did a nice 50 shot there. Water gun should KO. Of course you missed, dude. Like, what's your problem? Boop. Well, double Iron Tail. We had to waste two Iron Tails. That's whack. There's a floor, but I'm definitely going to go grab these items right here. There's two just in by my side by side. You get money because money's the most powerful thing in this game. It's like, <laughs> I think tiny Reviver Seeds are the most powerful. Let's step out here just so uh, people, well, they can waste their PP on their moves. Well, that should actually take out 243s. Yes, yeah, sir. But yeah, I think tiny Reviver Seeds, like, you can, if you stack up on tiny Reviver Seeds, you're usually good for mostly anything. If you have unlimited, unlimited of them, you can tee off. But why did I get a spin trap? Why am I always like getting spin traps? Can I like push this way? Yeah, we'll let we'll let Absol do the work here. Get a crate. Oh my god, I think that's a mean HP. That had over hundred. Nice. Stop being so confused. We got another poopy tar here. What you want? Iron Tail. Yeah. Oh, look at Kip, yo. Kip slid down there. I was like, dude, what is he doing? And he got the angle. We got a little hungry. I'll eat in a bit. I'll eat. Don't worry. We'll just get an escape board. But that's nice for like bigger dungeons like this, in case we have to escape. Like, we know we're gonna die and we don't wanna lose all of our items. You just use the escape board, you'll escape back to where you began, and then you keep all your items and Poke Dollars, which is type nice. Oh, yeah, give him that bite, Ski. Give him that fight. Give it to him. Yeah. What is this? What did I just. Oh, it was money under the snow. That's sick. That is sick. Okay, so. Which way? Let's check this way. There's gotta be a floor here, right? There's gotta be a floor. There is a floor, but I'm gonna eat. I'm gonna actually eat right now. Get that apple munching. Give me that. Eat that up, baby. Give it the tree cow. 
I could always just switch to my Pokemon and save hunger points. Or is that what they're called? Hunger points? I don't even know. We could save it that way, but I don't really like to do it. I kind of just like to stick Trico, play him. It's, I picked Trico for a reason. I picked him for a reason because he's my boy and Mugkit's my sidekick. So I don't really want to control my sidekick too much. Of course, yo, double missing attacks here? Get out of my face. But we do pick up the cat. Where is this floor at? Where is this floor at? Where are my steps at, baby? Show them to me. There they are. There they are. We got two chime shows. Yo, get them out of here. What'd you just do? What did he... Oh, our attack went that way. He growled. So I, I got special attack moves, baby. Dude, what? Like, why are we missing, like, every single attack that we've been using? Ridiculous. We've just been missing more than lately. Fuck it, take him out. There you go. Nice little tackle, Kipper. There we go. We're all restoring back to normal. Oh, what's called restored is PP. Absol's ability. That's sick. It has, like, a secret ability where it restores PP. That's so nice. That's honestly awesome. Yo, take out... Oh, they use Saquon. They can't get burned or anything. Right, yeah, yeah. Get him out of here. Get him out of here. Right, let's roll. Let's roll. Yo, Rain Dance is upon us. Oh, a TM, baby. What, what is this? She can pick up Dragon Tail. Oh, my lord. Maybe eventually I can learn that. Like, with Skeptile or something? I don't know. Because Mega Skeptile turns Dragon type, which is pretty dope. It's pretty dope. Maybe I can learn Dragon Tail with that big tail just swinging around. Rain dancing again, yo. <laughs> yo, my kids loving the rain dance, yo. I'm so glad I gave it to him. Especially because, like, when he cannot hit. <gasps> Bro! Second stage of Bagan. It's Shogun, dude. It is Shogun. Could you imagine if we had a Salamence on our team? And there's Megas in this game. That's, that's like, their big addition to the DX version. Is there's Mega Evolutions, which is unreal. It is sick. I cannot wait. I have Mega Swampert. Mega Skeptile on my team. Oh my lord. And just catch some other Pokemon like Metagross. All that good stuff. I want to send a Sandstorm. Yo, who's, who's the little biscuit sending Sandstorms over? Oh, yo, we take Buffets from it too? That's insane. That's that's whack. What we get? What we get? A nice little slow one. I'm going to head over here. I know Pokemon's coming here. We have Shell Gone. This should actually be super effective. Ooh, look at that. 55 Smack and Runes. We need Focus Energy. Yo, I'm just going to hit you with this. We got a Scarf. What kind of Scarf is this? We got a... Uh, Efficient bandana. That's type nice. Let's roll, baby. Let's roll. Got a I'm getting hungry again. Yo, get out of my face. What floor are we on? We're on 12 already. We're kind of smoothing through this one pretty fine. I might actually use a uh, a max elixir for Trico in a, in a little bit after I take out the speed car and this uh, shell gun. Yeah, we'll use a max elixir and just boost the PP through the roof for treats. But look at this angle we have. We have quick attacks. We are just counting all these guys. Yo, you really don't want to mess with me, my dude. Look at that. Get out of here. Nope, 48. Give me my 24 HP back. That is the best part. That's why I love going Trico. Like he, or like any grass type in Mystery Dungeon games, you get that Giga Drain, you get that Absorb, and it's a great way to actually heal up your HP and all that, just like mid-game. You're just chilling, you're just wrecking, doing moves, keeping your health up. Let's go. Oh, Hail is starting to come on us. That's insane. Well, it's not insane. It's not too bad. Hail. With all these Ice types coming in here, that's going to be tough news. That's going to be tough news. But all of our moves are back to normal, which is nice. Oh, nice little mud bomb coming out from Mudkip. Give me this Poke Dollar. But, dude, why? Why do I have to hit all the traps? Luckily, we got this. I, that actually does nothing for me. <gasps> a Subviper, dude. I always love Subviper. Dope. Dope, man. Dude, take him out, Absol. I'm not dealing with him. I just want this item. You ran out of PP as well? That's insane. But look at all the items. There's four items. What do you mean? What do you mean? We hitting everything right here. Like, legit everything. Every single trap we get in. This is annoying me. He's gonna go focus energy. I'll finish him off with a Giga Drain. 33. Get him out. Get him out of here. Oh, yes. Yo, we dropped a deluxe box. All right, I'm gonna step up here. Bite's doing some mean damage and a quick attack. Nope, 22. Give me that deluxe box. But I want to head up to those items all the way up in the top right corner. Tons of them. Let me eat an apple as well. Let me eat a nice little apple. Good thing I came prepared with all my apiles. With all my apiles. But yeah, we got a stack of four over there. Like, I really want him. The hail's buffeting me. Can you send a rain dance monkey up just to take off the hail? That'll be wonderful. Oh, yo, we don't heal up here either. Rain dance is a lovely move. Why don't you send it, my dude? Okay, I gotta switch that. Can I actually walk across this monkey can? Yes, sir, monkey. Look at everything monkey's getting. I'm gonna switch over to him. Oh my lord! Is that a slacking? That's a slacking. Can you send a rain dance, my dude? Mudkip, send a rain dance, please. Are you all out of rain dances? Please don't tell me you're out of rain dances. Yeah, I'm going to send one on, on my own. You want to play games with me? I'm sending a rain dance. So I can do that now. That is awesome. We can take away the hail and send it to a rain so we can actually regain HP and just stop the hail. 
That is type nice, to be honest. So that is what I'm going to be switching to Mudkip. When I want to get rid of the hail, say, nah, son. Just switch it up real quick. That's sick. So you guys can handle that. He sends the rain dance. Go ahead, Absol. You can handle it. Absol is going to quick attack through the Mudkip. Boop. Do some big damage. Oh, you're out of PP. Bruh. Do I give him something? I don't think I give him something. I say, out my face. To get out my face, I use the max elixirs. <laughs> but yo, he restores PP. Absol, with its ability squeeze out. It has like a, a special ability or like a rare ability, which is awesome. Dude, did I just hit a hunger trap? Okay, it didn't work. Thank the Lord. Thank the Lord it didn't work. That would have dropped my hunger. The weather became clear. Where's that money? Yeah. Yeah, 91, baby. 91. And so Viper wants the sauce. Yeah. One floor 14. This is insane. Insane amount of floors. I'm going to click that. Boop. I'm a little bit tap skis. Mud Bomb's going to fly through, and we're on our way. We got a lot of XP. We really did. But I cannot wait to, like, use all the dojos and everything. Dojos are going to be tight nice. To get all that XP back. Because we're pushing... We'll, we'll be level 30 probably after we use the dojo tickets, or, or at least close to it. We do Paralyze, I think. He sends a rain dance. I'm just going to send a quick attack. Through. Yay! I love quick attack so much. Like, quick attack's cool, but it doesn't hit hard. That's the problem. That is honestly the problem. What you want, Spiker? What you want, fool? Hmm. Iron Tail. Oh, why did I use Iron Tail? We are so far... Oh, like... Out! We are so far out, we can't reach it. <gasps> did you get poisoned? I was going to say, you poisoned my little kipper? You're going down, buddy. Don't you dare try to poison my kipper. Onward! Onward! <laughs> Yo, Absol just restored Mudkip's CP, so I don't have to give him anything. We find these floors pretty nice. We got a little Chesto Berry. That's type nice. We're getting hungry. A Link Box, I guess. I'll grab it. I have space. I have space right now. And then we're going to head over here. Oh, is that it? Is that it? No, a little checkpoint mark. Okay, that's fine. A little bit of checkpoint mark. We're going to go to deposit items. Get rid of some of these. What do we want to get rid of? What do we want to get rid of? We have tons of orange berries. Let's sort them. Oh, my orange berries. Get them out of here. Get them out of here. Okay, so orange berry, orange berry, orange berry, orange berry, orange berry. <laughs> How many do we have? Okay, we'll keep two. We'll keep two orange berries. We'll get rid of two tiny reviver seeds. Just throw them in there. Um, Dragon Tail and Link Box can get out of here as well. I think. I th oh, no. And then we got this front page. Uh, hmm. What do I want to do here? What do I want to do? Definitely get rid of a Max Tether. And we get rid of these two, and then we'll get rolling from there. That's perfect. That is perfect. So items in the storage. We're stacked up. We're looking good. We're going to get moving along and complete this Mount Freeze, baby. What are we on? Floor 16? Ooh-wee. Floor 16. Looking nice. Looking nice. Okay. Let's get moving. Let's get moving, baby. So we got some items over here. I'm going to head towards them. Let's get it, yo. I love how Trico walks. She's just sitting there prancing around. We got a link box. Do I mess with the dude? I'm messing with the dude. I'm not playing around. I got full PP. We're out here. We're ready to play. We got paralyzed in turn one. That's what's up. And look at Absol, dude. Absol's been a great addition. Steps over to the side to do some damage here. And we just take it out on our own. I'm not playing around. We don't need you, Absol. Absolutely. Actually, we, we want you, Absol. This thing just dragon breath me. You're about to get teed off on me. Bill. I need to dragon breath me again. Yo, my boy steps in front? My boy Mudkit just took a shot for me? The boy. The boy takes a shot for me. I'm going to take out this Viper and then I'm uh, and then I'm going to take out that Slacking. I don't want to face off on both of them. But yo, you see that? My boy stepped in front and took a shot for me. Kip, you're the best. That's why I picked you as my teammate. Oh, yo, we're getting some heavy enemies. Some big boys now. Slackings, Glalies. Oh, no, yo. This is not looking, uh, it's going looking, looking a little tough here, guys. Ladies and gents, a shell guns. We got see salamences. That could be pretty nutty. That step up shell gun. Just, oh, I can just dragon breath him here. That's tight, guys. He's gonna focus energy. And I'm gonna just quick attack him. Oh, you can't hit through that. That's whack. That's whack. So some moves you can only like range moves can hit through corners sometimes. It's weird. I'm not 100% sure how it actually works. The weather has became clear. Now we're moving along. Let's go. Here's stairs. On a 417. We're actually doing really, really well with this one. We're actually doing really well. We're kind of just flying through it, doing our thing, doing work on it. Find the stairs rather quickly as well, so it's nice. Rain Dance gets set up. Um, I think I'm two tiles away. He's going to slack off. <gasps> Bruh. What you mean, yo? This thing going to slack off and regain some of his HP. Get him. Now we're all just teeing off on him. <laughs> like, yo, you want to slack off? Yeah, we're going to triple team you. <laughs> Getting this Poke Dodge. How much do I have in my bank? We're well, not in my bank. In total. Let's step up, Glalie. You big, like, like, I don't even know what kind of Pokemon this is. Is it like an ice, a floating ice head? Kind of funny, though. Kind of funny, though. I kind of want to just, uh, 
I'll just Dragon Breath, see if he steps up, and then maybe throw a quick attack at him. Yeah, there we go. Boom. Because I don't want to get too close. He might just slam me with a nice physical ice move and just take me out in, like, one shot, which is scary. Like, I have tiny reviver seeds, but I'm not trying to waste them. Like, I'm not trying to waste them. The hail is coming, but the stairs are right here, so I'm not going to even change it. Oh, Mudkip's probably going to change it. Watch. Kipper going to do it. Iron Tail. Yeah. Absolutely take him out. Or we just double Iron Tail. Merc on him. Get a box. You'd love to see it. You know, receive with kind. Tiny Reviver, dude. This is awesome, yo. I love stacking up with them and just throwing them in my storage for a uh, further purpose. Or later purpose, however you want to say it. Let's go. Dragon Breath. Boop. Paralyze the boy. Must oh, he's going to just set the Rain Dance, yo. I love it. I'm loving Rain Dance, yo. You get the Rain Dance. Taking away his hail, all this weather effects. We get, we get 100 Poke Dollars. And now we're on the move again. Let's get it, baby. Where's the floor? I see two items over here, so I'm going to head up this way. And, oh, yo, this is the best. Item and stairs, Totter Seed and Poke Dollars. I'm going to take out, we're going to triple team up on this fool just to get some items. Yo, that's hilarious. This thing actually is a seed. Like, most Pokemon wake up when you're in a tile radius from them. Oh, there's actually more Pokemon coming in. I'm going to take them out. But when you're in a tile radius, but slacking, since he's like a sleeping Pokemon, he just sleeps with, like, while he, you're next to him. That's hilarious. Are any of these guys going to come down this way? No. Okay, we're going to head out of here then. Oh my god, yo, the hell is just coming down, baby. We don't want it. We don't want it. All right, let's roll. So, floor 19, is this it? I know we're close. Floor 19, oh my lord. 19 floors, this is insane. Rain Dance gets sent. Let's head up here. I feel like the stairs are rather close. I don't know, I just have a little sense. I'm feeling something. But I gotta take, I gotta start dealing down so he's good at least. Uh, can I hit that one? No, I'm gonna step over here. Oh my lord, yo, there are four of them. There are four Glalies. One up top, two down low, one to the right. Are you kidding me? Yo, we got T off on all these things. They were just like, they are just ganging up on us. A gang of Glalies coming after us. Take that one out. We're, we're chilling. We should be chilling here. I'm going to help out this one or Mudkip because I know absolutely can just absolutely T off on it. We got a crit. We double through on that. That's dead. Look at that. Built. Big bite. Double bite. Oh, see you later, yo. We just teed off on all those fools. Another Glalie, yo. I'm sick of these things. Let's click that. And it's a Viper coming up. Gonna double team. Kind of scared of that. And can somebody do something? Oh, okay. Kip, um... Uh, don't use. I'm gonna step back. Oh, okay, okay. I'm gonna Dragon Breath this. Can we use... Yeah, okay, okay. So, uh, Kip, yeah, you can have an Orange Berry. We'll give it to Mug Kip. Uh, no, do not use. We're just gonna give it to... Wait, what? I thought he used it for Kip! Oh, yeah, yeah, okay. Kip did use it. I was like, what you mean? He's sheer cold. Yo, he went for that one hit KO. Get him out of here. I'm gonna quick attack him. This should take him out, right? Absolutely knows. No, no. We do not. We do not want to use an Orenberry. I'm not wasting my Orenberries. Take him out, Kip. We need one of these dudes gone. Oh, he leveled up Mud Bomb. Powder Snow's doing work. He's gonna go down here. <gasps> he swaggered. So you're saying there's a chance. Take him out. Um, yes. Yeah, we're gonna have to use another Orenberry here. We have to use another one. We have plenty of them. Not even gonna lie. Mudkip gets the HP back. I don't want to step in front because then I would die. I'm gonna let... Hmm. 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 How should I do this? I'm actually do this. I'm actually switch to Absol and step in front. Yeah, you want to play with me now? You want to play with me? We're gonna slash you. No, this thing has slash and we didn't even know. What kind of moves does that have? Slash, bite, pursuit, and quick attack. This thing got, got some good moves. All right, we're gonna switch back to where it's Shriko. Let's get it. Okay, move, guys. Move, move, move. Get us a link box. Yo, what was that? They got the confusion on my boy Mudkip. We had to play that smart. Switch over to our, our Pokemon and roll out from there. All right, let's get going on. Oh, squeeze out, dude. That's That's been coming up clutch. What we got? Another tiny reviver seed. I'm loving it. Glalie, don't share stuff up to me. You didn't just see us whoop on four of your cousins. <laughs> this whole family came over there and we murked on them. What you want? Wake up! Imagine getting waked up by getting whipped by an iron tail. Let get up! <laughs> oh my lord. But yo, 420. It's gotta be the uh, last floor. This has gotta be the last floor. We got hail bumping on us. We're gonna go after this thing. Can you send a rain dance, Kipper? I don't like that a lot. Phil, wake up, buddy. Rain Dance, yes! Love you, Mudkip. Punishment, yo, don't dare hit him. Come on. Oh, oh, who's leveling up? Is that my boy Treek? Is that my boy Treek? Oh, let's go. 25. Move? Possible move? Two levels this game. Oh, he's trying to learn agility. Oh my god, I actually really want to learn this. I really, really want to learn this, but I don't know what to get rid of. I kind of want to get rid of Quick Attack, to be honest. Let's see, what's this do? It boosts the travel speed of you and your teammates in the same room. Oh my god, that is same room. That is huge. That could be good up against boss fights or when more Pokemon are chilling around here. I'm going to do it. I think I'm going to take out Quick Attack. Because I don't think we'll always have Quick Attack. 
I'm gonna take it out. We're going for it. We're taking quick attack out here. We have agility. That's gonna work so well for boss fights. We can double our speed and everything. We should get that speed boost. That will help us out so much. So I'm definitely doing that. We have Totter Orb. Yes, that was probably my my best call. And of course, I missed my Iron Tail. Let's go. So now we have a, a nice little move here with a uh, with agility. Nice team move. So now we have Rain Dance and that. Oh, what'd he do? Where'd he go? He ran away? He stole my box! What you mean? He took an item and it was one of my boxes. You hunk of junk. It said in the bottom right. Where's that slack? Is that is, he, is that him over here? I'm dude, I wanna find this dude and beat the pulp out of him. <laughs> is this you? Step up. Oh no, he's amnesia. I'm gonna step back here. Have him do some work. Can you set a rain dance, buddy? Oh, I'll dragon breath and go for that paralyze. Do him dirty. Water gun. Wow, oh, dude, his special defense is through the roof, and now he's slacking off. And of course, we don't have quick attack now. I'm agility this. Go ahead, boys. Go ahead. Eat it up. I'm gonna step up now. Let's go, yo. We faster now. You don't want the saws, yo. Look how fast we are. We're able to move around all that good stuff. Look how fast our body movement is. Like, yo, we go 10 times faster. I think we only have one more floor left, so I'm not gonna start wasting items. Can you use Rain Dance, Mudkip? Send it, Mudkip. No, he's gonna water gun. He's gonna crush me. Mm, Absolutely, you can take this position. Don't use. And Mudkip, I need you to send a Rain Dance, or I'm gonna force you to use a Rain Dance. I'm forcing you to use a Rain Dance. Here you go, Kip. <laughs> this is so my Trico can uh, heal up by just moving. So, we can use that. Oh! No! Oh my lord, thank you. Thank you. God sent sound from heaven. That thing might actually take me out. Nope, my boy's coming in clutch. Slide over here. I'm gonna actually agility the boys. Yo, let's go. Boost that speed. My best move. My best thing I did so far was to give, give, give agility. And now I can just move. Look how, look how many more turns we get with agility. That that was a great move instead of quick attack. Let's say I'm two tiles away with quick attack. I, I just usually use quick attack. Now I can use agility, step up, and use a bigger move. That's how fast we are. You're always flying. But here's the stairs. Is that it? Is this it? Let's see. Move, Absol. Let me just push you around. Is this it? 20 floors later. And yes, this is it. We have completed Mount Freeze. Now, is there a boss fight? I totally forget if there's a boss fight or not. And look at us. We make it to the peak here. And it is all snowy, hailing down. Coming down hard. Our boys are walking down like this. We finally arrived. This is a summit, isn't it? I wonder where Ninetales is. There they are. I spotted Trico. All right, I see them. Oh, no. Yo, the boys caught up to us. Are you kidding me? Yo, we've been running away from these guys because they've been trying to catch up and kill us. And they found us at the top of Mount Freeze. Like, who does that? They're just like, all right. They got to went up on top of that mountain over there. Are we going to have to fight these guys? I'm pretty prepared, I feel like. I have agility and all that. We will crush you with every shred of our power. Get them. Oh, what? What? So we just got a cutscene? So we don't actually fight him? But this cutscene's dope. Yo, look at this. Yo, look at Kip. Get him, Kip. Oh. Oh. Yeah. Oh, we hit this boy. Get him out of here. Slapped up on him. Yo, dude, this is sick. I wish we could actually fight him. Oh, my God. Cease this at once. Bro, that was honestly sick. What? What is this? Is this like, is a boss from now? No, it's Ninetales. This is who we came up to see. Ah, Ninetales. What, what? Ninetales? That, that's Ninetales. The legend was real. Look at it. Sees fighting at once, Alakazam. They are my guests. Oh yeah, tell us Ninetales. Who was the human that appeared in your legend? No, even before that, was the legend itself a true event? Depending on your reply, I may have no choice but to eliminate him. Whether they consider my curse to be a legend or not, I care not. However, it did happen. Many years ago, I tried to lay a curse on a human. It was then, however, that Gardevoir, the human partner, dashed in. It, se it selfishly be bore the full brunt of the curse meant for the human. Then the human did a selfish and cowardly thing. They abandoned Gardevoir and fled. The human eventually became a Pokemon, transformed into a Pokemon. The human. The human lives on. And the human would be? Who is the human that you speak of? It's me, it's gotta be. Yeah, yo, it's us. Oh, it says it is not you. Okay. So it is not us. That is wonderful. So maybe these guys will actually stop trying to attack us and all that. Mudkip's crying over here. Probably like happiest. Deep breath, Mudkip. In out, in out, in out. <laughs> Mudkip's adorable, bro. 
Woo! Oh wow, fantastic! Yo, look, he gave us like a hug! <laughs> That's hilarious, but hopefully these guys like stop bothering us now. That would uh, kind of be pretty nice. That would be pretty nice because they've been chasing us through mountains, so like three different mountains, all different boss fights, and then they tried fighting us up here with that cool cutscene. I'm a big fan of it, so that's pretty dope. And now they're all apologizing to us and talking about something about Gengar because Gengar was the one who ratted on us, tried to get us killed. We were going up against Charizard, Alakazam, and Titar. We kind of held our ground pretty well, so I'm a fan. I'm a fan of these boys. Good work, good work. Now, he uh, did Absol even step in and fight with us? Oh, dude, and then we got earthquakes? Quakes. The world's crust is shifting. The natural calamities are worsening. And the shifting of the ground. I will awaken the beast that embodies the earth. The beast that sleeps deep underground. Groudon will be awakened. <gasps> Bro, is she gonna awaken Groudon? So does that mean we get to verse him later on? I'm pretty sure we verse Groudon later on, but is that our next boss fight? That could be dope. Groudon and Kyogre. Oh my lord, those are one of my two favorite box legendaries. Those are so sick, especially Kyogre. Kyogre is one of my favorite. Him and Groudon, they're close together. They're just both such cool Pokemon. And sound like giant rock guy. Oh my lord. But Titar's kind of like him, but not fire rock. Kind of weird. But I don't even think Groudon is fire, which I think he should be fire. I think he's ground and rock, something along those lines. But what's going on here now? We put an end to our long journey, and I guess we're going home. Yes, they're welcoming them back at the team rescue base. Let's go. We complete Mount Freeze. And how many boxes we got? Oh, Rainbow Gummy? Oh, and Brutal Swing, yo. We get some good TMs. And another Rainbow Gummy from that DX box. Let's get it. Order the Deluxe box. Boom. Let's go. Let's go. Get some good items. I have to start leveling up my Mons and all that good stuff. Meanwhile, back at Pokemon Square, we got another cutscene. We got this boy doing some trouble probably again. Oh, he's talking about hunting down us. Like, yeah, yo. That, that story's all over now. Finally, after a long journey, we just talked to Gengar and all the townspeople, cleared up the space, tell them that the calamities were not because of us. We get some rest, and we make it back home. So we're going to head out here and see what's going on. I really just want to head to the town and uh, deposit my money, go check the Kelkion shop like we normally do, that we haven't been able to do in a while. Did you sleep well? All right, let's get right back into doing rescue missions. Flap, flap, our boy's here. Yo, Pelipper, I miss you, my dude. I miss you. What's good? He clunks up in there. And what's he do? Drop us some mail. And look, Pelper's bringing us mail already. Let's try to do our best like we always do, Trico. Yes, sir. Let's get it. What kind of mail you dropped for us? Check the mail. We got some new rescue mission. Well, not rescue missions here. That's just a bunch of um, useless mail. We're going to head into the town. No cutscene. So I guess we're just going to do some rescue missions actually further on the story. But yeah, let's go. He's glad he we're free and now he can give us business again. What do you got, my dude? Yes, I want to do some business. Yo, I got some cash on me. I got some cash on me today. Invitation. What's the, this doing? It's an invitation from an unknown center. Why would it happen? What would happen if you put in a mail slot of the mysterious room you sometimes see in dungeons? Okay. Oh, that's kind of cool. Kind of cool. Health orb, sleep orb. Uh, I really don't want anything. Actually, I'll buy an apple. Just to store it away. We'll buy this apple. We'll store it away. And we're going to store some cash here. Uh, what kind of TM do you have? I have some cash on me. I have some cash on me. What you got, my dude? What kind of TMs? Everyone's got to give us that same talk. It's just like, okay, yo, Trico, you back. <laughs> Come on, let me buy some stuff. Let's see, what, let's see what items you got. Does he have energy ball? I might want to buy energy ball. You actually might have it. Oh, no, I hit, I hit that. I don't want hyper beam. Uh, no. What other things? You got solar beam, thunder, facade, bulldoze, leech life. Ooh, but we can't learn that. Maybe we can learn facade and thunder. That's pretty cool. But I really don't want to learn any of those moves. I kind of just want some, like, stab moves and all that right now. We can head over to our bank. Actually, let's buy some uh, wiggly tough stuff. We got some we got some cash on me. No reason not to buy some wiggly tough stuff. Just a whole lot. Okay, let's see. We got a bunch of camps. Make a camp. List of camps. <laughs> and what should we buy? We can buy the bow planes. We can buy Mount Discipline. There's a Metai Tai Rogue. We can buy all these like little ones, which isn't bad. The crater. Oh my lord. Slugma and all that. We might want to buy this. That's 5,000. That's a heap. Bow bat, Dunspurs. Dunsparce. Oh, and then we get down to the expensive ones. Oh, this is where Mudkip can stay. Ooh, that's cool. That's cool. Deep sea floors. Oh, dude, these are getting expensive. They're getting expensive. Let's buy the magnetic quarry. I'll buy I'll buy a couple little ones for right now. Then start saving up my money. So give me that. Ta, baby. Yeah. We'll buy one more. We'll buy one more, and then we'll deposit the rest of the money. Yeah, I want to make another rescue camp. Let's buy. Oh, dude, I really want crater, but I can't. Jungle, Poison Swamp, Poison Swamp is expensive as well. To get a forest, we get, I want to see like what Pokemon we get in here. Vibrant Forest, Mushroom Forest, Overgrown, this is where Trico goes. 
Uh, Bob Bloom. I really don't need an aggressive, so I kind of want something good. Echo Cave. What's that one? What's this one? Sparrow. These are, oh, Houndor and Houndoom. That's not a bad one. That's not a bad purchase. Any, any other cheaper ones? These are muy, muy expensive. Yeah, okay, so we're just gonna go for the cheaper one with the Ravage Field. Because everything else is like 3,000 up. Like, that is insane. So boom, give me that camp, baby. Give it up. Give it up. All mine, all mine. Get it. Yeah. No, we don't want to make any other camps. And now I want to go over to the bank, deposit this money. I'll actually deposit all but like 300. Yo, what's up, buddy? We still have 3,000 left over in the bank. That's a, that's a decent amount. Your account contains a 3,000 on the dot. We'll, uh, we'll get rid of a thousand or we'll deposit a thousand. Probably a thousand, like a thousand two hundred. There we go. That's perfect. Put that away in the bank. I gotta start stacking up, saving up to do to buy other things. Oh, we got a max of other for us. And now we're gonna head over to you, Kang's Kong Storage, and fill up. Well, not fill up, deposit out. And just see all the items I have, dude. Kang's Kong Storage is where it's at. Let's deposit some items. Let's take it out. Oh, no, not take out. I'm gonna store. Look at all of our Geopath pools, though. We have tons of rocks. Let's store some items. Let's sort these. Let's sort. Let's get rid of an apple. Actually, three apples we'll get rid of. Others get in there. Um, any revival seeds we'll get rid of. I'll keep one on me. I'll get rid of this Chesto and Pets and Petcha. Get rid of these orbs and totter seeds and link box and slow ones. Get them all out of here. So we're just chilling. Now I just want to see my items. I want to see how many dojo tickets we have. Just, I just want to give a quick peek. Well, look at all these gummies. We actually have to use them. We'll probably use them in the next episode and all that stuff. Like I said, I want to use them when we got back. That's dope. That's dope. But guys, that is going to be it for today's video. If you did enjoy the content, don't forget to smash that like button for me. And if you're new here, click that big red subscribe button so you know when my videos go live. As in the next episode, we're going to be taking on more rescue missions, leveling up our rescue team, and trying to continue on with this story. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace out, everyone.